Jeremy with RC Worst here, and uh, today we're looking at the Myers 2 horsepower VR2 series residential grinder pump. Uh, moving towards the top of the pump up here, we have a heavy duty cable jacket that's sealed by a, a compression fitting, and the individual wires actually inside are sealed by a compression grommet for double seal protection against water intrusion. Uh, the motor is filled with oil to maximize heat dissipation and provide constant bearing lubrication for a long life. This pump also features an internal run capacitor to allow for high starting torque to assure starting under heavy loads, which is really essential for a grinder because things tend to get uh, caught up in the blades and, and with that internal capacitor, you know that it's gonna just rip it right up and, and suck everything through. Um, the VR2 is equipped with a built-in heat sensor that protects the motor from burnout due to excessive heat from any overload condition. It will automatically reset when the motor has cooled though. The shaft and hardware on this pump are all made of corrosion resistant stainless steel to ensure a long life so that they don't rust sitting in the basin filled with water. The shaft seal is made of an oil lubricated single carbon with a ceramic face. Stainless steel semi-open impeller inside the volute here uh, handles ground slurry without clogging or binding. Pump out vanes keep, help keep trash from the seal and reduce pressure at the seal face for longer life. Now let's get down to the best part. So the VR2 features a patent pending at seal cutter technology that will easily slice through solids, trash, anything you'll find in domestic wastewater without roping or clogging. Now, the stainless steel cutter on this pump right here is easily replaceable. Uh, as well and does not require dismantling of the pump. So the max flow that this pump can produce is about 33 gallons per minute and then the max head is going to be 138 feet uh, which is also 60 psi. Uh, last but not least we have the the volute here which is a heavy duty cast iron. Uh, it comes with an inch and a quarter vertical discharge but it's flanged as well so you can upgrade if you need a larger discharge. Um, it's also available in both manual and automatic uh, the difference there being with or without a wide angle float switch. You can find this and many other pump products at rcworst.com. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to like and subscribe for more content. If you had any questions or feel like I missed anything, be sure to leave those in the comments below and uh, we'll get to you. You might be featured in a future video. So we'll see you next time.